Happy Mother's Day to my beautiful mother, to all the beautiful mothers out there, to all the beautiful mothers that are yet to be, and to all the beautiful mothers that we miss. Hi, hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my beautiful, amazing mother, Nana Tanala. Thank you so much. Thank you for joining us. I'm going to be asking her some questions that I've always wanted to know. And before you enjoy this premium content, if you have not yet subscribed, I mean, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? You see? Even I know that line. If you can't deny me, you can't deny the queen. Oh, um, I so. <laughs> Alright, so let's just kick it off. Okay. Okay, so in what ways do you think I'm like you and what ways am I not like you? Um, you are single-minded. Mm -hmm. I like that. I think you are like mm -hmm. me in yeah. that way. But you are also very focused on a single target at a time, on a single goal at a time. I kind of, I'm heading somewhere and then something draws my attention, I'm interested and I kind of have a side thing, a little side <laughs> and I have to come back on my focus and yeah. my goal. So I think you're not like that mm. um, at all. You mm. kind of stay focused on one thing and you yeah. get towards it. Okay, okay. Which is a good thing. No, I definitely agree. I would say we're both creative. Okay. Yeah. And then I would say, um, how we not alike? <laughs> <laughs> Am I allowed to No, say no, no, it's like bad. That's because I can't think of how we're not alike, but I know I'm not alike in so many ways, but I just can't think of it. I think you're a little bit more story. <laughs> I am. Um, yeah, I have a more than... serious side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, not... but you also have a serious side. I think so. You also have a serious side, maybe. Sometimes. It depends. Anyway, that's all for it. <laughs> First question. Hopefully okay. Not. Mama, so what is your best kept beauty or wellness secret? And I will tell you guys that my mom has been like on health and wellness and this green juice she made for like 20 years before it was cool. So like what's one thing you want to tell uh, ladies in, in our 20s, you know? Um, I think self-care, self-care, self-care. And self-care is um, all-encompassing. Um, there are different forms of wealth. Um, your health is your wealth. Mm -hmm. You can have mental wealth, you can mm -hmm. have physical wealth, you can have financial health. But yes, a lot of self care. And yes, so this is actually a smoothie and not, sorry, it's a smoothie and not a juice. Okay. Uh, it has no natural sugars in it. Mm -hmm. And I think I've done this from when I was in my 30s. It yeah. has worked for me, it's helped me. Yeah. So I try and eat vegetables in all forms. Okay. But the simplest way for me is to make a vegetable smoothie. Smoothie, yes. That's actually delicious. Mm. And you know, you and just you think it. about what you like. And I mean, don't make something that's not drinkable or sati, you know, or delicious. Make it mm. nice and drink it. Okay, so that's yes. the tip is just a green juice. A green smoothie. A green that's smoothie. one of mine. But a lot of self-care. And mm. self-care involves looking at your mental health and looking at how you feel and really trying to be the best version of yourself. Yes. Okay, I love it. For you. I love it. I love it. Okay. Um, okay, so what advice would you tell Tammy 20 years from now? So what advice would you give a 45-year-old Tammy? What did you wish you had known at 45? I wish... I mean, it wasn't that long ago, but you know... <laughs> I mean, look at my mom. Is, my mom is a supermodel. She's young. So. <laughs> um, I wish I did a lot more than I did mm. in terms of my self care. Okay. I wish I did Pilates mm. um, from when I was much younger, in my twenties or even before. Uh, I wish I didn't worry so much mm. about many things. Mm. So the advice I would give you to me is self care, self. -care. Mm. If you if you don't have a wholesomeness mm. in you, your, mm. your your mind, your mind, your mind, your mind, you have to look after your mind mm. and your mental health. 
then you would project from there yeah. with everything you're doing. So it's important to yeah. softer, softer, softer. I wish I started much, much younger. Mm. Um, okay. So I know self-care is key, guys. I always say that, but now I'm going to even take it more into consideration. Okay, so next we have, how do you manage, like I feel like you have such a young spirit. You have like a very energetic, young, bubbly spirit. How do you manage it? How do you let it flourish? Whew. Um, I don't really think about it. I think it is innate. Mm -hmm. So you were born like that? <laughs> I think so. You either got it or you don't, or you <laughs> don't have it. I, I, I don't think I'm that young, bubbly. I mean, you're best, like, anytime anyone meets my mom, they're probably like, there's a 90% chance I'll be best friends with her. Or they think they're their best friends with her. <laughs> that's the difference. Thank you. I'll take that. Yeah. Okay, so um, that's just something we can't help you with. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, so, with how busy you are, you know, with your business, if you guys didn't know, my mom is the founder and CEO of Government Care Nigeria, the biggest um, dry cleaners in Nigeria. Can I show for you? Are you embarrassed? <laughs> She's actually on her way to work from here, so thank you so much. Um, we, we founded that company 20 years ago, 25 years ago. Uh, about 23, 24 years ago. Yeah, and other various investments, etc. <laughs> <laughs> so how do you manage all that with... I mean, also having four kids, and then also any time we need her, any time of the day, she'll pick up. How do you manage that? Um, you make well, you kind of you you never really perfect. Mm. You know, I I I'm still trying to make time for the things that are important to me. Work is important. My children are. Um, yeah, you just wake up each day and. Do, do what you can. Yeah, you do, do the can. best you can. Yeah. You, you, you check in with yourself mm -hmm. and do all the things that build you, hold you, keep you, and then yeah, you face the day. I guess everybody does that. Yeah, yeah. But you do so well and so elegantly. Oh, I, uh... <laughs> <laughs> it's too much washing today. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Next one, we mean. Okay. What's one thing you hope I it's don't do? Yes. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Go on. Hey, what's one thing you hope I don't do when I'm your age? Doesn't even have to be something you've done, but something you hope I I'm not you know I'm I'm not like or I don't do at your age. Um, I don't think you should give up anything you desire mm. because um, I don't think you should give up what you want for yourself because of. Um, Something else. Because of a man? <laughs> well, not necessarily also, not only a man, yeah. but that it could be a man, it could also be. I'm not sure how to articulate this. Mm. I think you should go after what you want. Go after what you want. Yeah. If you fail, well, well, you did it, you tried. Yeah. Go again. Try again. Yes, or well, you try something else. Yeah, yeah. something will work. Something yeah. will, will work for you. Yeah. I mean, something always works, you know? Something does work. If it not, doesn't work the not, first not time. Trying, Probably. Yeah, no trains from exactly. Yes. So, Mama, what is your favorite, and let's make it fair, what's your least favorite as well attribute of mine? Well, least favorite is you're too independent. From is that bad? <laughs> is that a you thing or is that a me thing? Well, I, it's my late, le it's my least Okay, okay, favorite. I respect so, it. Yeah. You're a bit stoic. <laughs> yes, I know that. So that's two things. <laughs> I love that word. Too independent. I think you know some people read I, I, books I, I, about how to be stoic. Yeah, but you you have to be balance. Balance is important. Yeah. You're stoic. You're too independent. I think body school did that. It was whose fault is that? <laughs> I didn't send myself to body school. And <laughs> then what's your favorite? My favorite is you're super organized. Okay. You 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 set a goal. You achieve it, and I'm like, what? You give it everything. You put it everything into it so for me no. i really like that you're very organized mm. with your life mm. and sometimes um yeah a third not favorite thing is also that you're not mm. flexible with your, oh, with your time <laughs> you're like i'm doing this now mm. i can't do this now you yeah. know yeah so. yeah i'm working on that guys okay um, that wasn't too bad thank you so were there any similarities between me as a child and you as a child. 
Papa must be a cute baby. Oh, uh, you're really super cute baby. Yeah, but our personalities are probably very different. Yes, you are calmer, you're chilled. I, I was a bit boisterous. I used to climb trees. Yeah, you know, disappear from the house. Yeah, and climb. Trees. Where did you grow? I grew up in Kaduna. Yeah, um, that's uh, northern Nigeria. Great childhood, running mm. around. You know that carefree. You, mm. know, you return to the house when you know it's meal time. Yeah. You know, just and what what age did you go to boarding school? Oh gosh, I went at six. Six. So I went to boarding school at seven. No, you, you did it. You went at eight. eight. Okay, eight yeah. and six. I All right. I that is better than <laughs> what I got. <laughs> <laughs> at least, right? Yeah. Okay. What's your favorite memory of us? I think it's us. You had a birthday. 18th? Okay, my 18th. Mulan Rouge. Yes. Yes. It was just mommy and daughter. It was? <laughs> Isn't the party going away? No, 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 it was the no, party. Paris. Yeah, was it your 18th or? No, I was a child. I was very small. Oh, when we traveled? I went to Paris for my birthday. That was nice. It was just mother and daughter. But I was like about nine years old, so that was okay. Well, yeah. Yeah, my memory is. I know that was lovely. I mean, <laughs> I think it ended in tears. <laughs> <laughs> we'll who keep was, it moving. Who, who was crying? You were. I didn't really know. Yeah, because you were sulking. <laughs> you, you, yeah, okay, well, you're, you don't sulk as much as you used to. I didn't know. Okay, so what is the one thing you would love to do that you haven't done yet? Hmm. I love one. that one. Wow. Mm. What do you still want to do? Well, I'd like to live on a farm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Grow my own. What is it about um, our family and farm? Like, my grandma on my dad's side um, lives and runs a farm. And you want to do something similar? Well, well grandma has uh, like chickens, livestock, she grows avocados. Hmm. Well, I mean, which country would you want well, to live on a farm? Um, yeah, for me, it wouldn't be that kind of... It's not farming like, you know, like commercial farming. Mm. I want to just... Be in nature. Yeah. Green nature, see mm. nature, and just be... Just mm. be zen out. Mm. Okay, well, yeah. let's make it happen. Hopefully. <laughs> okay, so... What was life like when you were my age? Hmm... I was navigating life. Um, at 25, I was a mother of two. So does it feel weird I'm a grown adult? I mean, I'm glad you finally realized that, that sometimes you're still a baby to me. Yeah. And then you're like, Mom! Yeah, I'm a baby to you, but I'm an adult. Yes, yes. I'm a grown woman. Yes, yes. <laughs> you're my little girl. Yeah, that will never change. But yeah, you see how, you know, when you were my age, you were so independent from me your family. I have to remember that. You have that. to remember that. Because sometimes there's a lot of pressure. Um, for me. I, yeah, I can't be the baby. I can't be the baby when I'm 30. Okay, so be a, a young, my young adult. I like to be babied, but I can't be the baby. Well, you milk it sometimes. I milk it sometimes. When it suits you, you're the baby. <laughs> then when it suits you, oh, I'm an adult, leave me alone. Yes. Yeah, so. Okay, so final question. If you were my age yes. and we met, would I be cool enough to be your friend? I don't think so, actually. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the truth, Tammy. You guys. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Video done. I can just explain. Uh, can you see how shady <laughs> my mother is? I think you're a little bit too reserved for me. Yeah. 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 Okay. Also, because I'm your child, there's certain sides of me you've never seen that you'll never Ooh, see. Ooh, I believe that. I mean, maybe you're two results for me. <laughs> well, but... there you go. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, but seriously. Like... <laughs> so, honestly, to be fair, I would want you more as a, a business partner. Okay. <laughs> you guys, uh, this is this is so wild. Goals or, you so know, you actually want to be my friend? Yeah, we can't go for lunch. Oh no, we can go for lunch, but to yeah. be best buddies. Because to me, yeah. your life is too organized. It's too, you know, like yeah. everything has to have a, a time slot yeah. allocated to it. And yeah. sometimes it's good to just 
be spontaneous and just leave. Okay, so we can conclude my mother would not be my friend. <laughs> there are many things about you that I really admire. Oh. No, you can't be upset. Guys, cut the cameras! <laughs> I'm trying to, to redeem myself. Cut the cameras! <laughs> No, you're yeah. just quite organized and kind of precise and okay. not very flexible. Okay, so, so yes. I'll add some chaos to my life. <laughs> no, no, don't! Don't do that! I don't know. You can't win, right? You can't win in this life, bro. I love you right so much. Now. Thank you so much for doing this. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Alright, my lovelies. I will see you in the next video. Make sure to drop a comment. What do you want to see next? And you know my outro. What's your outro? If you have not so yet, you're there. What if you, you have been thinking about? What are you even doing or thinking yeah. about eating? Okay. Okay. We have to do a pandemic one. We will. We'll eat pandemic together for you to realize. All right. Peace out. Hey, baby girl, Timmy, my adoring daughter. It's wonderful to see you bloom into the lady you're becoming. You couldn't be more delicious and amazing. And I love you to bits. And you know, your mama. Mwah.